game is that, uh, that you can make any of the characters whatever class that you want. Yeah. Oh, so you don't have to, like, wait and level them up to a certain point? Um, well, you can have to wait till like, you get to that level, but you can decide whatever weapon they have or something. Uh, yeah. Okay, we're gonna go in a... Yeah. Uh, that's not good. Um... I gotta have my flying unit somewhere in this game. Oh. Okay, we're gonna just... Um, yeah, we're gonna, like, give you some potions. Yes, I agree, Super Video Gamer 360 Spyro for Smash. <laughs> this isn't Brawl Fan 1's channel, don't worry, guys. <laughs> hey, you know what? It doesn't need to be BJ's channel for people to place their correct opinions here. Yeah. <laughs> Quote, unquote. Uh, hold on, okay. Oh my god, Flannery. I'm getting a... <gasps> Yeah, exactly. Oh, uh, he's yeah, sore Donald Goofy. Sore Donald for Goofy for Smash. Uh, you're you're gonna have to talk to both Square and Disney about that. And I think Disney yeah. are kind of getting their hands full at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. Not with Spidey though. He's he's gone. Yeah. For now. All right. Thanos snapped him again, <laughs> beyond the grave. Damn it, Thanos! <laughs> I like you better Perfectly when you... balanced, as all things should be. You know, Thanos, I like you better when you were getting pissed on by Cosmic Ghost Rider. I am inevitable. <laughs> and you know what else? You're also getting pissed... I am the Mandarin! But, but you know what? You're also getting pissed on by Cosmic Ghost Rider. <laughs> oh, right. That That is a thing. <laughs> yep. All right. I'm just going to now post this on the Tweeter Twatters. <laughs> oh my god, Cosmic Ghost Rider looks so stupid. <laughs> I mean, you gotta have something stupid looking. It's like, if... a, helm it's like a fiery helmet with uh, spiky shoulder pads, and is that the Punisher's logo? <laughs> Johnny, are you stealing uh, Punisher's ideas? <laughs> Maybe. Right. Maybe I am, maybe I'm not. <laughs> the world may never know. Yeah. Anyway, welcome ladies and gentlemen to uh, some Pokemon TCG shenanigans where we just open up packs. I've been holding off on a ton oh, of... Uh, I'll be right back. Sorry. Timing. Uh, okay. <laughs> anyway, I have been holding off on so many code cards because I want to open all these on stream. Every single one of these. Including, uh, including the 83 Unified Mind Packs. <laughs> okay, that's good. Alright. I'm so surprised, like, despite it being almost, like, right now September, we still don't have any information for our Pokemon Sword Shield. <laughs> yeah, because, like, the game comes out in, like, two months. Yeah, it's still terrible. We haven't even seen the evolutions for the starters yet. <sighs> I'm back now. Yay. So, um, yeah, Yay. so yeah, Jordan, we're about to start opening the packs. And, yeah, take a look at the 83 Unified Mind Packs, because we're opening all of those. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> but you want first, <laughs> but first, we're starting out simple, and we're doing the expanded stuff that I don't care that I pull from these. I mean, now that you said that, you might. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm gonna. Well, I'm opening them anyway. We only have one of each. Of them. That's how little I care about the expanded format. Ah. Uh. And we have a Pachirisu with the attack called Trick Sticker. Okay. Oh. That actually sounds kind of adorable. Oh, and the attack Pachi. <laughs> Pachi. Flip a coin. If heads, the attack does 30 damage. 30 more damage. <laughs> Yay, Is that good? <laughs> and so whopping 50. Ah. Uh, Which, you know. It's something. Yeah, But it's like, not much considering most of like the beefier cards that are often used have like 200 HP. <laughs> oh 
All this for a drop of blood. <laughs> All that for a drop of blood. <laughs> Says every ground type ever. And yay, we got an Archie's ace in the hole, guys. <laughs> what are we up to? 270 HP? Nope. Uh, if you've seen like the, uh, the the teasers for the Sword and Shield parts of TCG, we're getting cards with 330 HP. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> well, at least, uh, they'll, you know, at least cards will last longer than one turn. And we have our first EX poll. Latios EX. Yep. I already have two of these in real life. Yeah, as, po as opposed to your, what, 28 Mewtwo's? Yeah. Which I still don't have enough of. Yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> listen, huh? listen, Jordan. I just need the full art Mewtwo and Mew, and I need the shiny Mewtwo EX, the GX, okay? Listen, I know BJ said it was okay, but he's wrong. <laughs> yeah, everyone says it's okay. I don't say it's okay. <laughs> okay. Now to, now to open the one Guardians Rising pack that I got from uh, my daily rewards that I thought I opened some time ago, but I guess I didn't. Maybe we'll get a Tapu Lele. Maybe we will. It's a fucking hyper Tapu Lele, I swear to God. <laughs> nope. No Lele here. Just Oricorios and Rock Puppies. Uh, I like Rock fuck. Puppies. Now for Forbidden Lights. Wait, oh no, that's that's gonna be the next one. Burning Shadows here. Come on, let's go hyper rare Charizard, guys. We're totally getting that one here. Darn it! I'm so disappointed. We didn't get the hyper rare Charizard. Yeah, I know. Charizard is the best card in the game, like bar none. I mean. I mean, come on, I'd love to have a virtual $200 on me, but no, we're just never going to have that happen. Nope, never, no, ever. No, instead, we're going like to be like this beware who has an attack called Tantrum. We're going to throw tantrums. <laughs> yeah, that is, that's exactly what we're doing. Yeah. Now we do Forbidden Light. We may get Greninja's here. Yeah, so uh, Anuwa liked to post saying that Palutena mains have two brain cells. What's your take? Um, I take offense to that. I have one. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. You easily have three. Thousand! Ah, no. That, I, I'm pretty sure that's overestimating a bit. Let's it, see what we got. overestimating when it's talking about my bro. Yeah. Also, also hey, hey Malik. <laughs> yeah, hey, Malik. We just got a Pangoro who has an attack called Untamed Punch. <laughs> Untamed Punch. Goddamn Punch is still better. God, yeah, it is still better. <laughs> In fact, it's what I call Incineroar Side B in Smash. I know it's called a little and whip, but I don't care. <laughs> it's goddamn punch. But um, let's see. The Unbroken Bonds. Will we pull the Hyper Air Reshizard from this? <laughs> see? If I do, I'm ending the stream here. No, like the second you get it, you end it. Oh, but we do get this. I'm okay with that. Oh, hey. Um... Oh, uh, Greninja and Zoroark. Yeah, this is the alternate fall art. This, so I do have this one, like, in my... I do have this one in my binder. It was the last one of this duo that I ended up getting of this variation. <laughs> yeah. And I was on the big hunt for it. Like, I have the regular one, the fall art, the hyper art, and the alternative fall art. And yeah, this is the alternative one. That's gonna be going in my deck. <laughs> A Reds challenge. I uh, was playing Pokemon Masters. Very fun, but not easy. Great. I wish I could play it, but apparently oh. my phone is not, not, not compatible with it, and that makes. And me mad. I only have one gigabyte left. 
I want an Android phone so bad. I want to hear Dio possess Lieutenant Surge. I want my Cynthia. Well, it's not the Hyper Air. Uh. Oh, hey, Reshizard. <sighs> well, yeah, it's not the Hyper Air, but there it is. Wow, that, that is some cool art, I will say, though. It, it, is very, isn't... it is very cool art. Uh, T-Base asks, Isn't, uh, having two Pokémon in one card kind of broken? Eh, is it? I mean, they're very powerful, but the cost of having one get KO'd is that your opponent takes three prize cards, so you're already halfway losing the game. <laughs> so, like, if you run, like, a... So, if you end up getting two of your tag teams KO'd, you lose the game instantly. <laughs> Meowstick is Catterday, and this Cleffa's doing the Japanese ease method Catter of cursing. Day. And, and Cleffa's cursing us out in Japanese. Wait, is it? No! <laughs> Clef, fuck you. <laughs> oh, here's our first secret print of the, of the stream. Hi? What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Uh, oh, oh, metal cool. core barrier. Yep. I also have this one IRL too. It's in my binder, and uh, yeah, it's pretty good with steel decks. It's just that uh, it's too bad not too many steel decks are being played because Reshizar's running around. Yeah, and Steel is afraid of fire. Yeah, it's just like I, I'm not. De I'm not dealing with that. Pikarop can deal with it. Oh, and here's another tag team. Um. Oh, Lucario and Melmetal. Oh, speaking of steel types. Yeah. <laughs> Will you use that with me? Uh... Oh, I, I got a perfect icon. Actually, wait, no. No. Oh, a... we got a promo Tapu Finny. Finny. Oh, really? Yep, we got the promo Tapu Finny from the uh the pre-release sets. <laughs> I like fish. Wait, did you, uh, oh yeah, so, you know, did you see the, uh, trailers for, um, Sword and Shield, like, the gameplay of it? Uh, yes. Like, I think I have. I'm so glad we finally have a pub in a Pokemon game. And, uh, now we have ourselves the promo Terrakian. Hmm. Hey, Terrakian. Oh, hey. Yep. Basically, what I'm opening up now are the pre-release box sets that you get from a... Uh... Oh, oh Kitty's kid in the chat! Kitty's in the chat! Hey! So, yeah, uh, these are pre-release boxes that you can get from, of course, the pre-release events. And every single one comes with an evolutions pack that you can use for, like, the, for the event when you play against people to try out the set. And um, every single one comes with a special promo. Uh, there's about four of them that get printed. We just pulled two of them, the Tapu Fini and the Terrakian. Oh. Yep. There's another one in the set that's, uh, that's in Amoongus. I have plenty of those, because I got a lot of these things. Let's see if we can actually get it. Oh, we got the Necrozma Osma promo. Oh, cool. <laughs> also, Kitty says, get all the babs. I, I plan to get all the babs. I actually, you know, yeah. it's... Actually, it's funny she says that because uh, we're eventually getting a tag team where it is literally just baby Pokemon together. <laughs> yeah, That'd be it's cute. A, yeah, it's a, a tag team trio of Igglybuff, Cleffa, and Togepi. So it's literally a, ta it's literally a tag team of babies. Aww. And we got another Top of Finny. We did not get the promo Amoongus, but you know what? That's okay. Because now, we're going to open the 83 Unified Mind Packs. <laughs> oh, boy. Now, this is... Oh, I see a Cynthia there. Um, oh, yeah, because um, they can come with supporters and whatnot, and uh, Cynthia is often a common one to get from them. Dragon Goddess. And apparently she's getting rotated out, which is a sin. Uh, not, not now. Like, rotations oh. usually don't happen, like, because we just got a rotation. But, um... Okay. She's not, yeah, she's not going to get rotated out yet. Unless, 
Unless the Mad Lads decide to be like, okay, this next upcoming set, we're going to have a reprint of the Cynthia to keep her in rotation. Thank God. <laughs> Which, you know, they have done. In fact, they're going to do that with Cherish Ball. I mean, Cynthia's the most popular champion in the series, so it wouldn't make sense for them to rotate her out and not bring her back. Yeah, bring back Guzma. <laughs> Now, can we get the Hyper Immune to you from any of these packs? <laughs> I see uh, yes. Oh, oh my god, um, okay, so someone retweeted this. Uh, oh, we got a Dragonite. It's, uh, for My Hero Academia Season 4, and, uh, uh Izuku doing the same pose as All Might. Yeah. Hmm. I love that! It's our boy. <laughs> Yeah! Right now, I think uh, I'm actually like uh, doing a game plus for three houses, and I am in the house of waifus. So, Jordan, look at this young goose. Hmm. Huh? Let's see. It should not be smiling. That is a. Uh... Its attack is. You know what's happening to America. Its attack is called Cape the Cavernous Chomp. Oh god. Not carnivorous? <laughs> and also, this Jinx has a move called Attract Smack. Uh. That's, nope. That's, that is kinky <laughs> as shit. I bet that, um, I bet that once someone gets smacked, they immediately fall in love and become a masochist. <laughs> oh, oh you... Jinx hit me harder. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I think happens. Oh my god, it's a Drapion. With slicing blade. Hmm. And oh, we got the trollish reset stamp. <laughs> like, oh, what's that? You have one prize card left. Shuffle your hand and draw one. <laughs> and oh yeah, Grimsley has a supporter that not many people are going to be using. Ah, uh, Grimsley. Yeah, I literally have a Pokemon deck that I can't play since I don't have enough energy. Well, dude, uh, get Elite Trainer Boxes. They get you energy. Like, they give you an entire, like, package of energy that you can use. Along with, like, eight booster packs. And there's a Hapu! Who, I swear to God, in Pokemon Masters is voiced by Styx. Oh, really? Yeah, like, I haven't matched her yet. Yeah, like, I was hearing her voice work, and I'm like, is that Sticks to Badger? You yeah. mean, like, uh, Nika Futterman? Yeah! Hang on, let me look it up. Mass. Well, it's, uh, her voice, her role isn't listed yet. Like, some of them aren't, like, straight up confirmed yet. But I swear to God, that's who's voicing Hapu. I'm surprised at the thought that, like, um... Josuke's voice actor from JoJo is actually voicing fucking Blue. Yeah, he's voicing Blue. <laughs> I like what? Oh my god, you're, you're not. No, come on, what? Josuke, you're not a dick. And what's even funnier, Cassie? His mom is voicing Cynthia. What? Yeah. Tomoko? Yeah, Tomoko, <laughs> Tomoko's voicing Cynthia. Uh, I, this, is, this is gonna get into some weird crack family shit. Speaking of Pokemon Masters, though, I'm I'm surprised that they brought back Chris from Pokemon Crystal because not a lot of people played as her. I actually just drew her recently. Uh, how many did you buy? I oh, bought, never mind. Um, I bought a number of these. It's just that I've been holding them off for a while because I wanted to stream me opening every single one of them. So I just had this big pile of code cards just sitting next to me for like I think a month. <laughs> And it's Galvantula with the attack Livewire, which, by the way, in uh, Pokemon Insurgents, that is an attack. I'm basically like getting uh, my team set up for three houses. Uh, yeah. Still, though, it's just the. Uh, do you get a plan on getting uh, three houses or not? Um, I'm not. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. I kind of I kind of decided long ago that I wasn't a Fire Emblem fan, but 
with this game in particular, I'm <laughs> I'm starting to regret that decision. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, okay, do I play it? Do I not play it? Do I like these characters? Do I not like these characters? Why is female uh, Violet's design so bad? Why is male, male Violet's design so good? What the fuck? Yeah. With, real, uh, with, I... with real or game money? Uh, with real money. Like I said, I have um, I had code cards just sitting next to me for like a month because I wanted to mass open these on stream. Well, at least we got the DLC design for Violet, so... Oh, DLC. You want it? Yeah, there's DLC for uh, Violet's outfit. Let me just uh, look for it. It's uh. Yeah. Um, and here's I our might first. And use that for female Violet then, if that's the case. And here's our first GX from Unified Minds that we pulled. Umbreon and Darkrai. Yeah, this is the one that IRL I am trying to pull a second one of because my deck that I'm running it needs a second one, and I only have one. Uh. Here's the design for the, uh, for Violets, for Violets, but Violets. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's much better. And we get another GX! What is it? 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 Uh... Weavile. Okay. Yep. And the thing is, I needed a second one of these, too. And this is the second one I got on here. Oh, I see. How do I have godly pulls? Uh, simple. I pray to Palutena every night. Uh, Cassie, is, um, the DLC outfit- are the DLC outfits free? Um, I think you have to pay for them? I'm actually, like, Damn trying it. to get one- I'm trying to get them right now. Oh, okay. And uh, I'm loading a bit of a chapter. Uh... Alright, cause, uh, my main problem with, uh, female Byleth is that her design has- so many things wrong with it. Like, for example, her navel is showing. That's gonna get stabbed. Two, she's wearing stockings in a war. Um... It, if you, you do realize it is a fantasy RPG, and you can change job classes, right? I mean, yes, you but you're in job. a freaking war! <laughs> and so is the nature class, but no one's saying anything. But you, 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 and you know what? How, can we just appreciate this awesome Lucario art here? <laughs> Oh yeah, huh? it is an yeah. it is a nice artwork. Yeah, look who's in the back, yeah, yeah. Garchomp and Giratina, which is funny because they're a tag team you can pull in the set. Oh, but yeah, it's like I I don't know why people are complaining about Byleth's design when it's like like it, it's I don't know. I think it's just one of those things that bothers me and only me. But you know, because yet again, it's like why why is everyone getting upset over the design for Byleth? I mean. I just like the female design a little more because it's like at least it actually stands out more than the male design, which is very boring to me. Oh my god, it's Tapu Coco! Maybe just because I kind of like the. We also have an Uxi and a Poipel. <laughs> oh, Poipel. Yep. Anyway, you were saying? Like, as I said, I was like, whatever. It's just, a, it's just like an RPG fantasy design, so whatever. And I mean, there's literally like fighters. It's like, there's literally a dancer class, which I'm surprised no one has said anything about that. Um, what's the function of the dancer class again? Is it just to like uh, raise morale? Um, raise morale, and I think having the ability to have this ability to make another unit move. Huh. We did. Yeah, that's actually pretty helpful. Well, we did it, guys. <laughs> it, the meme is He's here. You. The See, I told you you'd get it. <laughs> well, that's not. Well, th it's not the hyper rare. That's just the regular full art. Which you know, that's the one I need IRL in order to have like all the versions of Mewtwo Mew. Also, um, yeah, Kitty, to answer your question earlier, yeah, this is a tag team where you have two Pokemon together, and uh, if it gets knocked out in battle, your opponent takes three prize cards. But as a result of that, they're like extremely powerful. And also, your boyfriend would think you're a dork. Your boyfriend is a dork, okay? I've uh, seen, I've seen like what he does. Like, he has no with, room to talk. Like, I have seen what he does with those giddy pace. He is a dork. Yeah, he is. I'm just like, yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, I don't really care too much about the design. Yeah, I mean, it could be worse. It could be Pyro and Mithra's design. <laughs> Yeah. 
true. <laughs> Jordan, just imagine if she looked like Ryuko when she s synced with Senkets. I would just throw the game out the window if I had it. <laughs> <laughs> Like, okay, at least Byleth has a little slit in her armor where you can stab her. You can pretty much stab anywhere in that case. Yeah, if I had already complained too much about the outfit, because there's way worse outfits than what Byleth is wearing. A actually, no, yeah. Jordan, you want to know what the funny thing is? Apparently to remedy, like, a lot of the exposure that Senkets leaves for Ryuko, uh, Senkets can actually harden itself into steel. <laughs> Uh... <laughs> like, uh... Legit, when I, uh, saw the first episode of Kill a Kill, and when Ryuko was getting fired at, I was like, AIM FOR THE BOOBS! The tag team that won't ever leave me alone! <laughs> oh yeah, Rella and Alone and Executor. God, like... Jor <laughs> no, Jordan was there, like... I think it was, uh, yesterday, wasn't it? Um, yesterday or the other day. Yeah, we're like, I was, I was opening, like, physical packs and whatnot, and he could tell you, I pulled this thing three fucking times. Yeah, he really did pull it three times. It was, <laughs> you could just, you could just sense the frustration in his voice. Yeah, like, here's the thing, though, here's the thing. I just got, like, I originally used to have, like, seven of these like physically and six of them were of this regular art i got rid of five of them just to end up pulling three more <laughs> <laughs> like this thing won't leave me alone <laughs> fuck off rollin <laughs> take Dumb your, eyes is better take your palm tree with you <laughs> <laughs> come back we are number on a dark ride Speaking of the Rowlett family, how the mighty have fallen, right? I mean, everyone <laughs> everyone used to love the shit out of it and hate Incineroar, but then it's like, it's like it flipped. Incineroar is now one of the most popular uh, Alolan Pokemon. Yeah, well I mean, Decidueye is good in its tier, but that's just kind of a... Yeah, it's just good in its tier. Yeah. Also, um, this Meloetta art, um... Garchomp, what are you doing back there? <laughs> it's, oh, I also just noticed Giratina back there. What are you two doing back there, huh? Ooh, pretty. I want it. Well, I mean, it's not hard to pull from the pack, so you could probably just pull it. Also, this Musharna has an attack called Rest Well. Dang. I mean, as you should. I mean, you should. Get healthy sleep. Also, Hydratini. With the attack called Jump On. Hmm. <laughs> oh, and how can I keep ignoring this Pikachu who has the attack Meal Time? Um, I already heard this joke about that specific Meloetta card. Okay, so I'm not the only one who notices this. Good. And we have a Latios GX here. And it's ready to purge tags. <laughs> I hate tags. Oh, also, Jordan, Clear Vision GX. Oh. Latios has visions. How can you have visions? I'm a legendary bitch. I, I don't like its ability, though. Like, if you have four of your Pokemon in play, this Pokemon can't attack. Like, I, I don't like that. That's dumb. I will worship you, platonically. <laughs> also, hi, gumshoes. This thing is garbage. 
It's like, all right, I'm about to do my head, but oh no, there's a GX or EX in play. I'm only going to do 30 damage. I'm too scared. <laughs> Get gum juice the fuck away from this stream. <laughs> okay, on to the next pack. <laughs> yeah, uh, Kitty, that's exactly why. Okay, so I can pull two of these on stream, but not in real life. Okay, fine, I quit this game forever. <laughs> Hate my life. <laughs> No, you gotta give me number rallets and a lone executors. No, you, you can't give me the things I'm actually looking for. Meanwhile, TCG Online is like, Haha, sucks to be you. You can't print these off and take them as your own. No, because that's considered illegal. Even though it would save a lot of heartbreak, just saying. <laughs> All the times I want, it's like, the one time I'm looking for duplicates of something I want, and I just can't fucking get it. It's only when you don't want them when they show up. Y you know what? That's actually the case. Because that's what happened with Weavile. As soon as I got, like, my second physical Weavile, I'm like, okay, cool, I don't need to get this anymore. And then suddenly, I open up another, I get another Weavile, I'm like, oh, come on! <laughs> it's like, well... <laughs> If I had this kind of pull luck, my deck might actually be good. <laughs> Is so excited for Pokemon Sword and Shield, as are we. Yeah. Yeah, we are! God damn it, TCG Online, why do you do this to me? <laughs> <laughs> Did it... <laughs> it gave you another one?! <laughs> Fuck it. Well, the thing... Fuck it, owls uh... and palm trees. <laughs> Sun Wu, use fire punch. <laughs> Did you sacrifice a bat to Palu? Nah, just a Republican. Agreed. <laughs> wait, why, why did I agree? I am tired. I can't wait for my vacation. Okay, here, here we go. Here's a tag team for you guys. What? <laughs> More tag team. Slowpoke and Psyduck. <laughs> oh, wow. That's a team combo. <laughs> The full art of these guys is just messed up, though, because it looks like Psyduck is humping Slowpoke. <laughs> what? Uh, does... Oh! Wait, yeah. It's the other one, right? Yeah, uh... Yeah, uh, the full art one, not this one. Like, if I, if we pull it, then I'll show it all, because, yeah, it looks like Psyduck is humping Slowpoke. <laughs> and Slowpoke... The jokes people could say. <laughs> it's, oh. And Slowpoke is just there going, like... Oh, hey... <laughs> and Psyduck's <-Dex's> like, No! <laughs> I, my, I took my medication. I don't yeah, have the headaches anymore. Yeah, and, and hey, it's a, it's GX attack. Thrilling times. So maybe, oh, maybe they, I still maybe can't they do the Donald Duck voice. I don't know why I keep trying. Yeah, maybe they enjoy it. And, oh my god, we did it, guys! We did it! Stream's what'd over! You get, what'd you what? get? What'd you get? Stream's over! What? We're done! <laughs> Hang on. Hype. Oh, you got the, yeah, you got the hyper rare. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. So, oh my god! So, guys, we just pulled the most valuable card from the set. This card, how kitty, with pure luck. This card is ninety dollars, and. The funny thing, too, is that, again, while I was opening packs with uh, Jordan in a call, he heard me pull this, like, IRL. I have. Yeah, I fucking flipped. So, uh, and... even, but no, I needed to complete the meme in my binder. <laughs> <laughs> that you don't have enough Mewtwo's when you clearly do? <laughs> Listen, it's just 28, come on. <laughs> 28 too many. I mean, to, to be fair, uh, two of them, uh, like, two of um, the Mewtwo Mews, I am thinking of trading just because I do want to get the full art version of this because I don't have that one. But yeah, th that card is fucking $90 and we just pulled it on stream. And oh, God. 
Team I one. hate you, TCG Online. I loved you before, but now I hate you again. <laughs> Insert Rihanna here. It's like, why, why do you taunt me? <laughs> I need one of these in real life! I need my second one! <laughs> you oh tell me you don't want me! Now look, Toxapex. Oh, best water wall. We're pulling so uh, many GXs in this stream. <laughs> and we got another GX! We're pulling these things like crazy! No, uh, Brian's relationship with TCG is... Actually, I shouldn't make the joke. Uh, it's too dicey. Joke abort, joke abort! <laughs> I was about to make an abusive relationship joke. <laughs> and I mean, then I realized, wait, I shouldn't be saying that. I mean, it abuses my wallet. It does. <laughs> what are you sacrificing? I told you, I'm sacrificing Republicans to Palatina. <laughs> hmm... Oh my god, Licky Licky. <laughs> with the attack- Life I'm on. With the attack, Licks go crazy! Uh, wow. Kinky. She must love them. No, she, she likes it when I sacrifice them, because I'm making the world a better place. <laughs> and we did it again, folks! <laughs> The meme continues! Wait, did you get- Yep, you got another one. <laughs> the meme continues! God damn it! <laughs> By the also, way, it should be perfection. We already did the cat puns last set. But, uh, by the way, the regular version of Mewtwo Mew is, uh, 20 bucks. Hmm. And from what, I, from what I heard, it may be getting a price drop just because of the uh, promo tin that's coming out soon. Which is stupid because Reshizar never got a price drop despite also having a promo set for it coming out. Charizard's fucking privileged. <laughs> I, I'm trying to figure out how to purchase stuff uh, on... <laughs> I didn't realize my mic was uh, muted. Uh, Brian. Uh... Didn't you say that Missy's Favor was also 20 bucks? Yeah, Missy's Favor is also $20. Okay, that's what it reminded me of. Yeah, but, um, yeah, apparently Mewtwo Mew is getting a price drop because a promo set, like, for it is coming out, which includes the alternative full art, which I think is stupid because Reshizar never got that. Once you download this complete exit... Aren't they aliens, not cats? Well, Mewtwo is a mutant. Mew is... A really ancient Pokemon. Yeah. Deoxys is an alien, though. <laughs> yeah, Deoxys is an alien. Yeah. Uh, uh, I think it's called... I think it's a super virus, actually. Yeah. Also, I want to bring this up. This Aegislash has an attack called Trash Slash. It's not even poison type. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it doesn't even, like, inflict double damage to poison type Pokemon. That makes no sense. I mean, technically... It can if it's a card that's weak to Psychic, because Psychic and Poison are all classified into the same color. That makes no sense. Because he, it's because Poison is sometimes colored purple. So, Psychic and Poison are the same type in TCG. Yep. That's disgusting. Oh, Jordan, you're gonna be happy what we got here! Wait. What is it? 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 Come on, stream, catch up, catch up, you motherfucker! Dragonite, full our Dragonite. I have the regular version of this in uh, my binder. I don't have the full art or the hyper rare of it, but you know, this <laughs> Dragonite looks cool. Sky Judgment, though. Mock delivery. I like that. <laughs> Mock delivery. Sky Judgment. Dragon Claw. Is that a fucking anime reference? I mean, maybe. I mean, hey, because wasn't there this one Dragonite who kept delivering mail or something? Yeah, that's uh, the first movie. 
Oh, that was just the first movie, not the series as a whole? No, it was just a thing in oh. the first movie. It's okay. You make that coffee. Another Dragon Knight. Yep. It's so cute. Yep. So cute, but so deadly. I love it. Yeah. You see, those versions of Dragon Knight we call Baby Dragon Knight. Because it's not the GX version. Yeah. Meanwhile, you know, this Obama Snow has Wild Tackle, and this Slack King has the ability Counter Attack. Oh, it does. Wait a minute. It's standing on its two feet. It's not being lazy. <laughs> is is Truant, like, not in effect or something? <laughs> Someone did skill swap on it. Gave it moxie. <laughs> oh, my God. Just imagine how slacking, uh, how terrifying slacking would be uh, on the first turn of Truant, where it spent one turn being lazy. Now it's just wrecking shit. <laughs> <laughs> Shooting hyper beams out its nose. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, now I fixed it. Another I'm spinning. Up. Okay, now I finally have the uh, DLC. Hell yeah! Yay! Yeah. Now Violet's tummy won't be so cold. It's a it's a skull unit farm. And we got another GX. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, especially when it comes to cold winter. Mobile. Yep. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, Cassie. That's all right. Has the attack Wily bite? Oh, hey, did you see the uh, Persona Five, uh, the Royal trailers? I have not. Uh, I haven't seen uh any recent trailers, but I did see a meme. Uh. It that's basically saying, I'm excited for this. <laughs> I think it was a picture of Futaba saying, games need buy or something. Yeah. Which is so relatable. Why do these attacks sound like dirty jokes? I mean, some of them do. Yeah, some of them do. Oh, oh God, look at that camera up. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, hey, baby. Yeah. I'm wearing the cloak. There we go. Now I look like an official. Now oh. I look like a school. By the now way, I am a professor for real. By the way, I yeah. want to point. I want to point this out too, because um, I know I believe the last set also did this, but like it was recently they started doing this. They started doing things for like the baby form of Pokemon. And uh, basically, you had they gave them abilities where like you could actually use them on the first turn. You could actually use them, but upon using them, your turn ended. But there were instances where it's like you would technically be able to have an attack even if you even if you took the first turn, which I think is interesting. Why not? I don't know. Oh. Uh, fun fact about Why Not, for those who don't know. Um, apart from a difference in tone, uh, its Japanese name, Sonano, is nearly ho uh, homophonous with the phrase Sonano, which means really, or is that so? It's played out by its evolution, Wabafet, whose Japanese name of Sonans is homophonous with the introduction Sonan so, which roughly means that's the way it is. We got another GX. We, we do? Yep. Mo oh! <laughs> the it's the full art mobile this time. I thought visually Gen 3 Pokemon were just weird. Is it just me? I mean, given that you're in a tropical region, it makes sense for them to be exotic. Yep. And then meanwhile, <laughs> someone looks at you and is like, oh, wait till Gen 5 you get ice cream. <laughs> Am I God? I don't know. Yeah. We got if you are God, you're certainly a benevolent one. Well, we got a f well, our first full art supporter, one that I actually do want physically. Coach trainer. I, I want it because the waifu is cute. Oh, what? you want it for waifu reasons. Yeah. It's another welder. 
I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, well, hey, 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 to be fair, I'm pretty sure this one's not as expensive as Walder. Because that thing's like. Or 30, as like, compelling as Walder. Yeah, because that one's like 30 fucking dollars. I think this one's like 8. And then there's a BHM with mysterious noise. And Psy Punch. With that dreadful attack stat, never in your life, BHM. <laughs> this licky licky with licks go crazy, that still fucking gets me. Actually, <clears throat> what is your physical attack stat? 75. Yep. Bad. <laughs> it's like, you ain't punching people anytime soon. What's that mysterious ticking noise? <laughs> <laughs> Understood that reference. Should we continue on with it, or...? Uh, maybe. I haven't pulled anything mind-blowing just yet. Okay, I'll start. Snipe. Snipe. Severus Snipe. Never mind! <laughs> we just did! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Snape is sad now. <laughs> oh, the unicorn. Yep, we got another Keldeo. And for once, he's not showing his butt. <laughs> calm down, Chugga. Calm down. What is the what is the obsession with Keldeo's butt? <laughs> also, Jordan, look, it's a Misty's favor. Misty. Kissel. <laughs> she's a jerk, but she's my jerk. Well, actually, no, because I think in uh, I think in Pokemon Masters, she's actually a lot nicer. Oh, yeah, yeah. she is nicer. Yeah, it's just let's no. let's be fair on Misty's part in the anime. Ash is fucking stupid, and he yeah. did wreck her bike. Yeah, like, he never uh bought a new one for her. No, what's even funnier is that he just kept blowing up other people's bikes. <laughs> Nebby? Oh yeah, you do see a Nebby. It's oh, Cosmo. Oh, oh yeah, with Splash. That for some reason does damage. <laughs> WHAT?! <laughs> it does 10 damage! <laughs> what?! It <laughs> do zero! That's the whole point of Splash! TTT, you are wrong in every possible way! But Goddamn Punch is still a nice name for a move. And Luminous Blade, so... <laughs> Honestly, that's one of my fin Like, as much as I do like uh, playing the TCG, the thing I love doing more is just ripping on how there's some things where it's like, that's not even how it works in the games. Come on. <laughs> but that's not how Pokemon works. <laughs> for one thing, Garchomp isn't a fighting type. <laughs> no, okay, so you see, the thing is, for the fighting type, um, rock, ground, and fighting are all categorized as the same color. Which is weird because... Doesn't a uh, dragon have their own typing? Yeah, it took them a while for them to get their own typing because they used to be classified under the colorless <laughs> with uh, normal and flying. Okay, so Garchomp pretty much lost its dragon typing in the TCG. Eh, not entirely. There's some that do get printed with a dragon typing, but it's just that the thing is, I <laughs> well, understand. In that case, it's just inconsistent then. Well, no, because you see, the thing is, I understand why they do it because. If the more types that they end up having to make exclusively, like, for something, that's more individual energies that they have to make. Okay. So. Well, I guess that makes sense. Yeah, so, like, it, it helps save, it helps save with, uh, spacing and deck <laughs> organization. Like, I, I'm, I mean, like, I get, I get your reason for, like, why you rip on it, but it's like, yeah, I, I get the reason why, but, you know, again, I also like ripping on TCG for that kind of thing. <laughs> But yeah, no, like, uh, back to, uh, Ash blowing up more bikes. Yeah, that's, uh, that's what happened to May's bike, and that's what happened to Dawn's bike. He blew up May's bike? How dare he? Yeah, he blew, yeah, his Pikachu blew up May's bike. <laughs> Pikachu and bikes just don't mix. Oh, so Pikachu's the one who blows them up. Yeah, like, he just electrocutes the bikes. And also, to be fair on Dawn's part, she tried to catch Pikachu not knowing it belonged to Ash. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Surprised that doesn't happen more often. <laughs> oh my god, we got a channeler. 
didn't they get creative with the art on the cards as the years went on? Like, they used clay models as well with 3D art and some strange styles? Yeah. Like, uh, a lot of the art, not, a, a lot of the card art is still, like, really fucking good. Like, in fact, um, <laughs> yeah. this gibble right here, entirely crochet. Yeah. Yeah, like, they'll do they'll do things like that. Like, sometimes I'll have people who just illustrate stuff, some people who will make models, uh, whether it be, like, from uh, arts and crafts or, like, straight-up 3D models. In fact, that's, and then, that's yeah. most of, like, the GX stuff. Like, most of those are just 3D models. Neither have I, Kitty, but everything I need to know about TCGI, I uh, learned from Brian. Yeah. Not that I want to play TCG, but... Knowing enough to know, maybe it's not for me. Jordan, look at the stream! Hang on, it's catching up! Okay, I see... Espeon and Deoxys! Yep. Espeon's best Pokemon. Yep. Es or at least it's my favorite Pokemon of all time. Yeah, Gardevoir being second. Yeah, Espeon's got a tag team too, which you know, I still argue that I feel a more appropriate tag team would be Espeon and Cresselia. Yeah, I totally agree, yeah. because uh, Umbreon and Darkrai have a tag team together, so why wouldn't Espeon team up with uh, Darkrai's arch nemesis? Yeah, like, I mean, I, I get the I get Deoxys, because again, they're both psychic types, so it's like, sure, we can put them together because they're the same type, but like, I think theming-wise, it would have been more appropriate. Yeah, it was a huge missed opportunity on their part. Yeah, like, I mean, that's something I would have done. It's like, you know... It's like... Also, here's a Mesprit. Yay. With the attack, first contact. That sounds like a song. Uh, is it? I mean, it might be. Hang on. Mm, no, but... Oh, it's a Star Trek. It's a Star Trek reference. <laughs> and another GX! What is it this time? Yo, imagine someone only having one GX. Crazy. I mean, I hope you're not projecting there. Oh, Aerodactyl. <laughs> it's like, I hope you're not projecting there, T-Bates. <laughs> God, I just, I'm just seeing Kitty's reactions in the stream. I'm just like... Meanwhile, I'm here just being like, I wonder what certain things I'm going to pull. And meanwhile, she's sitting there going like, how are you getting all these GXs? <laughs> and how, how, how? <laughs> she probably wants to strangle me. Also, look, flying EMZ and a bug catcher. If you only heard me. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it's an Electros. Guess who has no weakness? I guess what? This is TCG! You do have a weakness, fucklord! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Numble, Numble is adorable, I agree. So is Katani. And there's a bounce sweet. Don't bore it. <laughs> I'ma do it. It gets bored a lot. Picky Peck's like, I'ma do it. Picky Peck, don't do it. Oh, and here's an Escavalier with the attack discerning spear. Did you know that Joltik is only five inches tall? It's a tiny boy. Poor girl. It is. Uh, I believe it shares its height with, uh... Um, what's the pre-evolution to flow at? Um, Flabebe? Flabebe, yeah. It shares the same height as Flabebe. Jordan, look, it's an Azelf. Azelf! My favorite legendary. You noticing a trend? All my favorites are psychic types. <laughs> By the way, uh, while we were on the subject of, like, card art earlier, I kind of want to bring this up now, because, like, this is something that a lot of the cards do for their art, and I find it a bit lazy, where they just take N. Sugimori or, like, any other, like, pre-existing artwork for a character already and just slap it onto a background. 
Yeah, I don't like it at all. Uh, they even... They're even guilty of doing it for Cynthia and Caitlyn's card. They do it for all the supporters. It's lame. Yeah, like, there's... Okay, there's a few exceptions where they do it, like, uh, Lily and Hal have, like, some of their own, but it's like, I see things like this, and I'm like, all you guys did was just take pre-existing stuff and then just put it onto a background. Yeah, that's what we're saying, Kitty. Yeah, like, th these are already... Like, these are ripped straight from the games. And it's like, again, I get, I, mean, I get it, time constraints and whatnot, and it's just easier to do it this way. I just can't help but find it underwhelming, but like, though. At the same time, you think back, wait, if they can make unique art for all the Pokemon, why not do it for the trainers, too? Yeah. Well, no, they sometimes do it for the Pokemon as well. And it's like, you know, again, I get it. They want to be able to, like, get some of these done as quickly as they possibly can in order to fill out the set. But at the same time... I get a D-minus for creativity. Yeah, but it's like, at the same time, it's like, they stick out when you put them next to these with much more unique artwork. Also, this fracture has the attack I mean, guillotine. It doesn't instant KO. I mean, it it's kind of half and half accurate because uh, there's only like a, what, 20% chance that you'll hit something in the actual games with guillotine, but if you do, it's scary. <laughs> Okay, it's either uh twenty or thirty percent. Let me let me check it. Yeah, joke, let me jokes let me check on that. you. I get a skill trick. No guard. Guillotine. What did I type of scene? Okay. Uh, guillotine has yeah thirty percent accuracy. I'm a nerd. Well, you know what? I get a skill swap no guard out of this Pokemon. Oh. <laughs> Pervy camera up. <laughs> <laughs> Strutting his stuff. You guys, my humps. <laughs> my lovely lady humps. <laughs> also, this Fletchling has an attack called Flap. <laughs> flap. It... Oh, I'm it. Fletchling's Flap only does 10 damage. This P Dove's Flap does 20 damage. And. How much damage does Splash do again? Ten. I'm noticing a trend here. <laughs> also, this P Dove's glide does ten damage. That's a very painful glide. <laughs> like, yeah, what do they do? Just fly into you? <laughs> Boop. <laughs> no, like, they don't even make an effort to like use their talons or anything. They just fly into you. Okay, so that's all the unified minds. So uh, why is Splash even a move? Uh, it's a joke. Yeah, it's purely a joke. Well, not in TCG, because they're trying to take it seriously. Apparently, Nintendo just revealed the fourth DLC fighter is coming from SNK. Just got a post from Game Explain member Ash Paulson. He retweeted. Uh, is it from a credible? Is it from a credible source, Malik? Yeah, because if it's not from a credible source, I'm not gonna believe it. But anyway, the hidden fates packs. These are interesting because, like, God, Kitty, if you were mad before. Uh, about how good my pulls are, Hidden Fates fucking spoils you. Because it is very possible to double hit in this set with, like, really rare stuff. And there's about 200 secret mm, egret prints in this. I thought Shantae was supposed to be in Smash with her next upcoming games. I WANT HER TO BE IN SMASH! MY GOD! <laughs> and, um... This... I know her spirit's in the game, which I know might deconfirm her. But there is a chance with these last two, uh you know, DLC fighters, that they might change their minds and surprise us. But how, we have to wait and see, wait, unfortunately. Uh, how much is TCG Online? Oh, you can get it for free. You just gotta go to Pokemon's website and download it. Sorry for getting preachy on you. It's all good. But anyway... I like Shantae. She's a dork. But anyway, this set is primarily early known because um, it comes with a lot of shiny Pokemon. Oh yeah, it does have shinies. Yeah. Including the shiny Charizard GX, which is like $500. Speaking of shinies, we already got it! What, what, what? Uh, <laughs> show up, show up, show up. Uh, oh, Articuno! Shiny Articuno! <laughs> Yeah, I was trying to figure out which Pokemon was shiny. <laughs> yeah. Also, here's an Eevee. Which, by the way, this set does have shiny Eevees. Because it wouldn't make sense otherwise. 
<laughs> as well as uh, shiny variations of the evolutions. Espeon being one of them. Right. Oh yeah, also, this set reprinted Pokemon Center Lady. Wait, not not Nurse Joy? Nope, they just refer to her as Pokemon Center Lady. Because I think Nurse Idiots. I think Nurse Joy is just an anime thing. Uh, no, uh, I think in the games they refer to her as Nurse Joy too. All right, well, fuck me. Then. Unless I'm mistaken. All right, well, fuck me then. I think the only game where they don't do that is Unova, where I think they clearly tell you it's not Nurse Joy. Uh, they reprint older cards. Oh yeah, they do it all the time. By the way, look at this Lapras. Lapras. <laughs> God damn it. It's not how it's pronounced. <laughs> yeah, it's, an, it's sort of an inside joke between us. Uh, there was this... I think you can tell the story better yeah, than okay, I can, so Ryan, actually. Yeah, okay, so back when Pokemon Go worked on my phone, and I was I actually had people like play Pokemon Go with... Uh, there was this, I ran into this guy who was catching a Lapras, and he's, and when he ended up catching it, he's like, yeah, I finally caught myself a Lapras. I'm like, wait, you caught a what? <laughs> and he's like, Lapras. The, the fuck's a Lapras? And I look at it, I'm like, you mean Lapras? He's like, yeah, Lapras. The dumbest pronunciation I've ever heard for Lapras, ever. Still better than how I used to pronounce Snivy. Yeah. Well, I think a lot of people used to pronounce it that way. And even then, like, I can, I, I can get that. Lapraise, no. It's Snivy. Did this person have a fedora on? No, they did not. Oh, uh, okay. Here's what I was getting at. Erica's Hospitality has unique artwork. Why can't the other supporters be like this? Yeah, and hey, so does this uh, Misty's Water Command. Oh, uh, Misty's Favor had unique art too, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. And <laughs> why can't they do this more often? Yeah, like, look how good this, look how good this looks. Like, especially yeah, look at like, Misty's arm here. Potential? <laughs> like, there's so much motion behind this arm here. It looks great. Yeah. Uh, anyway, be right back. All right. Uh, were they a neckbeard? Um, they sounded like one. <laughs> Oh, here we go. We got ourselves a shiny. We got another shiny. And you know, I, I think I'll wait for Jordan to come back before we move on, because I, I think he will really appreciate the shiny we just got. Oh, see? Oh, dang. Yep, shiny Curlia. Which is actually, which is, uh, which is funny, because um, I have the, sh physically, like, in my binder, I have a shiny Ralts. Which, um, with that said, yes, there is a shiny Gardevoir in this set, and I do want that. I tweeted the link to my Twitter. Okay, I'll check it out after the stream. Um, actually, um, Kitty, I think also in this set, um, shiny Suicune is a thing. I'm just gonna wonder, like, when they'll reveal any more um, evolutions and stuff from Turn Shield. Yeah, I, I just want to see. Um, yeah, I just want to see like what other kind of new Pokemon they're gonna be adding. I just hope we get to see the uh, evolutions for the starters. Yeah, I want to see those too. Because it's been a like we need because we, we didn't get any information yet. Yeah, no, no, no surprise. Those haven't been leaked yet. Yeah, I'm like, wow. <laughs> They're keeping it very quiet after, like, what happened to Sun and Moon. <laughs> well, I mean, like, the the evolutions for the starters are all normally, like, the first things that end up getting leaked. Because that happened with Gen 6 as well. And Gen 7. Yeah, and yeah, and Gen 7. So it's like, okay, fine, we're just not going to give you information on the evolutions. Like, Come on, we just want to know. That's what you guys get for leaking shit. <laughs> no... I'm excited. Yep. Also, by the way, for the uh, shiny variations of the cards, 
you may have noticed like a little A symbol down here. Uh, that means that, that means that these are basically what are considered alternative arts. Uh, the company have confirmed that alternative arts do not count as reprints. So if it is an alternative art of something that's been rotated out of a, of a certain format, you cannot use it in that format. Oh. Yeah, so like you could not use this Curlia in the standard format because Burning Shadows has been rotated out. But you know, which sucks because it's like there's some things that got reprinted in this set where it's like I kind of wish that we were we'd be able to keep them because they're really good. Yeah. Yeah. In fact, Cynthia has a new full art in this set, and that is also another one that I want, but it's also fucking expensive because, of course, it is. Oh my god. Yeah. I see uh, on Twitter someone reblogged the uh, a scene. Oh no. Yeah, it's the, uh, apparently about the whole, like, oh, she needs to. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, they need to get new clothes for the girl. So while I have a question, what is the worth of a Japanese dark energy with triple star, two the two big white ones, and one tiny traditional black star? Uh, hmm. Well, energies in general just don't really cost all that much unless they're the secret print energies, which I think all of them are around like thirty dollars. And then there's um, then yeah, then there's like the double colorless energy that I know about. Um, I think those also aren't too expensive either. Like, g generally speaking, energies just aren't that expensive just because they're rather easy to come across. Like, you can either get them through, like, theme dags. You can get them through elite trainer boxes. You can pull energy from packs. Like, you're you know, like for, for every pack you get, you're guaranteed at least one energy. And yeah, you know, so sorry for holding on this for a while. Yeah, again, I'm waiting for I'm waiting for Jordan to get back so um, he can see the shiny curlia. Oh. Um, let's see. Oh, this this uh, energy. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's worth much at all. I think it's like I'm, I want to say like it's probably about like five cents. Yeah, that that's just the thing about energies. Like even a lot, some of the even some of the special energy stuff. Like a, thought it was super. Well, actually, um, yeah, um, those star symbols there. That's actually not uh the black the tiny black star. Like that is the rare that that is like uh the rarity, but um the two the the uh two um white stars that are on that card that's not a rarity that's actually used to tell you what set the card comes from like oh, like as you can see here like um next to the a symbol on this uh curlia you can see like a little island thing right here uh that is the set symbol for burning shadows to show you okay this is the car this is the set that this card came from hmm. Yeah, I, I think that um, I think the double star emblem came from like a really old set. I'm just like looking at the new characters, and I, and I still can't get over Team Yell. <laughs> it's, it's yeah. so, they're a rabid fan base. Yeah, and I love it. I get to be like, oh, cool! I get to destroy the fan base now. Uh, do you think the SOS Wild Battle, Battle Horde Wild Battle slash Double Wild Battles will make a return in Sword and Shield? Um, I think they could. I think they could do that. Yeah, I mean, it, the the system is powerful enough. They could. Yeah. It's just that probably Alolan forms are um, probably Gatlin forms. Like, yeah, that made sense because you know, 
Pokemon change whenever they appear in a new region. Yeah. But, yeah. like, the Z-moves, nah, I don't see them coming back, because that, that is, that's technically explained why they, they can't come back. Yeah, that that's an Alolan-only thing. Yeah, so... Yeah, see, it moves that I don't think they're going to come back. It just sucks. I want to drop a giant boulder on my enemies. <laughs> it's like, here, take this giant fucking rock. Although, Gigamax, you know, Dy Dynamax forms, though. Gigamax, <laughs> I got to make them big. Dynamax, Wailord, use Body Slam. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited. This is a giant crater in the fucking earth. <laughs> also, I'm looking at the rival's designs, and I realize the, um... I think her name is Marine. Yeah. Yeah, I realize her shoes can be can really hard if you think about the spikes. <laughs> but yeah, just but those? no, it's like, I just imagine, like, so how is the Grand Canyon created? Well, it all started with somebody died a to Waylord. <laughs> Kaiju size battles go. I mean, hey, we can have we can recreate Godzilla versus Mothra with Volcarona and Tyranitar. <laughs> the go, my big boys. <laughs> I will say, I also do like this Jolteon though. I think its ability is interesting. Like. Basically, anytime your opponent attaches an energy to one of their Pokemon, they take damage from doing that. Which is actually really deadly because energy is like the lifeblood of Dex. <laughs> actually, you know what? Here, I, th I think just to try to get a move on, I'll, um, I'll, post this, uh, I'll post this screenshot in the chat just so Jordan can see what we got. Because, yeah, I kind of want to get a move on with this. Gotta, I've been on the screen for a while. Oh. Right. Never mind. Mm. We're just we're just gonna pull more god. <laughs> oh God! What? Fucking Christ! <laughs> oh my God! Hyper rare Moltres, Zapdos, and Articuno. That is dang. Oof. You know, I wouldn't mind actually having this in real life, because it looks pretty. Yeah, it does look really nice. Yeah, and with a whopping 300 HP, step down, Magikarp Wailord. <laughs> yeah, you pulled the three boys. Oh, no, I didn't just pull the three boys. I pulled the Hyper Rare. That is... So... Yeah, I want to... So, all together, okay, we pulled... I'm back. So uh, okay, so Jordan in the chat, I um I posted shiny curlia. Yeah, I see shiny curlia, and look at the stream. Oh, uh, the Canto birds. Yep, the hyper rare. Nice. With Sky Legends as the attack and Trinity Bird. What do you think of the oh, new Pokemon that were revealed? I love them, especially Galarian yep. Weezing. Yeah, <laughs> what I love even more than that is, uh, <sighs> shit. What's um, Linoon's evolution? Obstagoon, Obstagoon. I love how they're uh bringing back ev evolutions, but changing them into regional evolutions. That's such an awesome idea. So Jordan, we got two evolutions here. Vaporeon oh. and Jolteon. Yep. And the Jolteon's actually got a really devastating ability. Yeah. Dang. So, any t if this Jolteon is your active, whenever your opponent attaches an energy to one of their Pokemon, they take two damage. Oh my god, yeah, the uh, Zigzagoon line being basically Kiss, and I'm like, yes. <laughs> uh, also to everyone, what Pokemon is your favorite in each type? If you've been watching me for a while, you'd know my favorite is Psychic. Uh, I think he's, like, asking, like, what our favorite Pokemon is of each type, which, um, I mean, I believe there was, like, a chart thing oh. that people would make for that. Yeah, I think I did one Yeah, I think it. we'd have to make a list of it, because okay. if we oh, explain here we right go. here now... This, this is an example of a double hit. What? We got a double hit. 
Huh? Oh! Uh, what? Uh, we got Mewtwo. Mewtwo GX and Hiker? A full art Hiker. Oh, yeah. Hiker, Hiker David. So, yeah, this could actually happen with the physicals of these packs. You can get double hits like this. <laughs> Hiker Owen Wilson. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Troopy. Chipper. Yeah, that's why the Hidden Fate set is amazing, because that can actually happen in the packs. Like, that's not a TCG exclusive, online exclusive thing. Speaking of shinies, we got another! Huh? Uh, stream shouldn't be this delayed. Glycopod! Shiny Glycopod. Speaking of which... Swole bug. Speaking of which, fucking... Guzma's Glycopod is a whipped bitch. <laughs> it's like, imagine just chilling in your Pokeball. Wait, what? Uh, Gene Simmons responded to the Zigzagoon line, liking it a lot. Seriously? Nice. But no, like if you guys haven't been keep what, haven't been watching the Sun and Moon anime, G Ash is currently fighting Guzma, and then Glycopod's emergency exit activated upon a uh, Toracat sending out a fire blast, and then out just came Caesar, who just takes it face first. <laughs> Wait a minute, why would Ash teach Torcat fire blast? Because the anime doesn't do physical special splits like you think they should. Apparently yeah. not. Uh, that's... Oh my god, I just learned uh, Torcat's Japanese name. I was looking up its stats, and then in the corner of my eye, I saw its Japanese name. Nyahit. Yep. Nyahit. Oh, we got another shiny! Huh? We got another shiny! <gasps> oh! Magnezone! And here's the thing. Despite the fact that this is an alternative art, because Ultra Prism is still in the current standard set, this thing is standard legal. You could use this in a deck for the standard format. Huh. And meanwhile, um, yeah, he here's an example of like, uh, yeah, this Graveler where it's like, oh, hey, we're just going to take Ken Sugimori's arm and just copy paste it on the background. Snore. Yeah. Meanwhile, you just look at all these other ones. Look at this Farfetch'd. <laughs> Huh? Oh, uh, Kitty, Magnezone actually is a tank in the context of the main series. Yeah. Uh, hang on, give me a second. Yeah, well, Magnezone's main job is, because its ability is Magnet Pull, is that it's supposed to bait out other Steel types, and then you send your Magnezone out, and the Steel type can't escape. Like, you want to sn you want to just snag them there. Yeah, and that's specifically for, uh, competitive, uh, competitive reasons. Yeah. Um, its defense, its physical defense is 115, which is amazing. Yeah. Um, its special defense is 90, but honestly, that's enough. Yeah. And its highest stat is its 130 special attack. Yeah, which even then, like, Magnezone's, like, main thing that you want to use it for is if anyone's using a Skarmory, you want their Skarmory to come out, send your Magnezone out, and then just nuke the Skarmory, because it can't escape. And it's weak to electric because it's part flying. Yeah. By the way, uh, Jordan, check out this far-fetched. <laughs> I love my little child. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Uh, who loves his lick, attack, who protects his lick, but most of all, who snack his lick. Ah. <laughs> okay, I'm, tur I'm turning into my shuckle impression. <laughs> Sadly, there is no shuckle in this set. What the fuck with the shuckle? Ah. Oh boy, Blaine's last stand, yeah. X-Men The Last Stand wasn't a very good movie. <laughs> and again, oh. they just used... Oh, what? Nikki, would ha Nikki would have my head for this. <laughs> what? what? So, uh... You guys Diane C. Shiny Diane C. Shiny, shiny oh. Diancy. Yep, shiny yeah. Diane C. And then she oh, somehow... Yeah. And then they, they, I'm sorry. Yeah. It's been a long week for me. They would uh, just interject in the call and say, you have a Diancy? Yeah. Well, I'm, okay, to be fair, like, I sometimes make the same mistake, too, because I've just, I have been calling uh, I know, Nikki for a but I still feel like shit whenever I do. Right. So, like, it is something that I'm also getting used to as well. So, yeah. 
Hmm? Uh, yeah, uh, Nikki goes by they and them pronouns now. Uh. I see. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that, by the way, internet. Absolutely yeah, nothing wrong. No. There's nothing wrong with it. Oh! oh. <laughs> what? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my God. He's hyperventilating. Oh my God. What is it? Oh Shiny Charizard! Oh my God! That's amazing! Okay, we won the stream! <laughs> WHY CAN'T WE PRINT THIS?! <laughs> WHY CAN'T WE PRINT THIS?! THIS IS AMAZING! Oh, sorry you dropped your coffee, are Katie. You, are you fucking kidding me?! I don't think it is. WHAT?! OH MY GOD! I never heard you freak out this hard before. GUYS! This thing is five hundred dollars, and I'm so mad because it's not real. I know. If it oh, were. God. <laughs> okay, uh, Kitty's clipping this part of the stream. Thanks, Kitty. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, thank you. Guys, I didn't know you could clip YouTube cl uh, streams. Guys. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda wanna end the stream right now! <laughs> I, I straight up wanna end the stream right now! <laughs> oh my god, that is so lucky! Oh, awesome. oh, oh, looking at its GX ability, I guess you could say we're raging out! I am raging out, I'm fucking pissed! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is, that is, yeah, that is pretty annoying, I, 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 rage. I, I wish I actually pulled this in real life! I mean, knowing your luck, you might eventually. And the thing, yeah, it, we got another double hit with Wigglytuff GX, but it's like, no, this is our biggest <laughs> concern here. Wigglytuff is just okay. Wigglytuff actually looks kind of creepy. Uh, go back to the Charizard. Thank you. <laughs> oh my god! It's... I'm showing it my friend Alex this stream after this. Oh my god! I, God, why, why? <laughs> Because God hates us. God hates because me! Because Arceus hates us. Yo, fuck you, Arceus. You're a piece of shit. Your base stat's been usurped <laughs> six fucking times. <laughs> Got a Pokemon and you're not even stronger than Mewtwo. Why 500? Because it's Charizard. It's literally the reason why. <sighs> You know what? I'm just gonna press on. I'm just gonna press on. Yeah. And you, you can you can find me in the corner just fucking crying. You're gonna press on and <laughs> on and on, says Fiora. I swear, I got, if we pull a second one though, I am literally ending the stream. Oh my god! Like, that's a, it's not even a joke. If we do end up getting a second one, I am actually ending the stream. Well, well, okay. We we got another shiny Curlia. What? Hey. I can see why it's over. Yeah. You know what? After that shiny Charizard, everything is so underwhelming now. Yeah. yeah. Which is weird because I don't think we even like Charizard. I mean, at least I don't. I mean, I like Charizard, but it's like I don't think it's like I I can I know it's downsides. And look, more yeah. more shinies. Yeah, I don't I don't hate Charizard, but as fire types go, it's Underwhelming. Yeah. Look, uh, especially since it can't Mega Evolve anymore. Look, oh. look more shinies. Shop it! <laughs> you know, I hate feeling like this. I should be excited about getting so many shinies in a row, but that fucking Charizard! <laughs> it just ruins it! That fucking Charizard had to ruin it. And look at this. This Eevee has an attack called Curiosity and Spin Tackle. That, that's great. It's not a shiny Charizard, though. <laughs> As an Eevee fan, I'm offended. <laughs> that, why do you have to make me do Eevee like this? Eevee's cute. Oh, hold on. Oh, look, shiny Ralts. Ralts! <laughs> or shiny of Ralties. Shiny Psychic Baby. 
with furry feet. Yeah. I gotta wonder, is that actually Ralts' feet, or is it just loose fur? And if that's the case, then are all Ralts, are all members of the Ralts family furry? <laughs> I like Charizard, but there's far more better fire types in Sunrun anyone, anyone? Or Infernape. Or Arcanine. Or even... Alright. Uh, I'm back. My, my folks just wanted to know like, if there was anything up with my feet, because apparently they were looking at my shoes and there's like a hole in my soles. Oh. But, you know, wow. They're, no, they're fine. Anyway, yay. Shiny Ralts. Again, I should be more excited about this. Oh, fuck you, Charizard. You brought down the stream. <laughs> yeah, you ruined the mood. This is why no one likes you, Charizard. <laughs> Fucking asshole. Yeah. Erica. Yes. Erica, hug me. I feel like dying. <laughs> My pigs are screaming, help. <laughs> oh, there's Erica. The bigger question is, do penguins have knees? Do you'll, that. Hang on, let me check your anatomy. You'll you have to ask a penguin. Penguin anatomy. <laughs> anatomy, not anatomy. Oh, look, this Mr. Uh -oh. Mime has an attack called Happy Mime. Hey, Happy! <laughs> and a Kangaskhan. Okay, they do have them. knees, but they're really far back into the rib cage. Oh, and look. They this, have really short femurs. And look, this Kangaskhan has parental fury! <laughs> Make everybody happy. <laughs> uh, okay. oh, yeah, oh yay, we got another shiny GX. Let's see what this is. You know what? Its GX attack is appropriate. That's exactly how I feel right now. Extra energy bomb. Oh, and yeah. that's your face. Yeah, that that is my face, and its GX attack is my fucking mood. <laughs> And this uh, stream is crushing and burning right now. Exactly. That's my mood. Electro Ball. Yeah, it is. I, I, I didn't know how to fit Electro Ball in there. By the way, penguins do have knees. They're just really far back into their bodies. Meanwhile, the uh -huh. Snorlax has an attack called Incredible Snore. Uh, it's like you're about to tell you this time. Don't let Charizard see that Erica card. It will burn it to a crisp like it does to grass. That is okay. That, that card in general just sucks. It's never going to get that chance. I'll kill it before it does. I'll kill yeah, it myself. Yeah, Incredible Star. Uh, that's how I feel most time. Oh, look, we, got our, we got a full art supporter. What? Let's see. Yep. <laughs> we, we got... Giovanni's exit. Exile. Uh, Exile, fuck. Yeah. I, I got, no, on, honestly, I don't blame you because th some of the text is, uh, it is like overshadowing like Giovanni's head. So it gets kind of. I mean, not even that. Giovanni's hair is almost the exact same color as the font. Yeah, so it does get cut off. So like, I, I don't, I don't blame you for making that mistake. Yeah. Or our box. Let's open up another. Please don't let me get another shiny Charizard. I'll actually be fucking pissed. <laughs> oh god. Would you like a pig? I, I wouldn't mind a pig. We got more shinies! Yay! Drampa! Wait, shiny Drampa is orange? Wait, it's Jorn. God what? damn it, I can't see I can't unsee it now. Droppa is, right, 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 is Jordo. Oh, great. He's up your shit. Oh, uh, ew. Shiny Droppa is Jordo Giovanna. Uh, ew, why did you have to remind me of that OP fucker? Hey, guys, it's me, Droppa. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I still don't like Jordo Giovanna. That, that guy's just... Yeah. 
Uh, I haven't gotten to that part of JoJo yet, but... Hmm. I just gotta say this is someone that's watched part 5 and doesn't like it. Yay! I'm, yeah. a, I'm a happy boy again, because look who we got! Uh, yeah. uh, uh, Shiny Wooper! Shiny Wooper! Wooper smile! Oh, Wooper makes everything better! Wooper smile makes yeah. me happy! <laughs> Yeah! Once again, to quote Tiger Conroy, if you can be that happy without having any arms, then you're just the king among kings. Shiny Wooba! Mm -hmm. He makes you happy! Yeah, he does! Also, here's a Magikarp whose splash also does 10 HP of damage! It shouldn't do any! <laughs> I like the artwork, though. I do, too. Yeah, it looks nice. You know, because that number's not going down, I don't know how many more we have left. Oh my god. Oh look, it's La Praise. <laughs> uh, are you still friends with that person, or...? I, I, I mean, I don't, I don't know if I'd say I'm not friends with them any, anymore, I just don't see them often. Right. Yeah. Just imagine if they're watching the stream and we're just ragging on <laughs> their pronunciation of Lapras. <laughs> it still sucks. Yeah. The prey sounds like some sort of weird praise plan. By the way, I have to ask, who is the genius who taught their Chansey Double Edge? Why would, um, you, why would you do that? <laughs> Fuck, I was about to give a serious, a serious answer to that. Oh, okay, uh, th this is gonna be the last pack. Okay, so what are we getting here? And... No! <laughs> God damn it, I'm mad! What? Oh, what? I am actually mad! What? 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 Shiny Greninja! Why can't, oh, God. why can't I have this in real life? Why is it a piece of digital data on a computer? Brian, help me! No, help me! I'm being mad! I'm contemplating life! I wish I could help people. I'm, I'm stuck in- I'm stuck in the internet. Help. I know you're stuck in the internet! That's what makes me mad! <laughs> That is that is just oh wow. Is this I, worse than the shiny Charizard or? You know what? Given that Greninja is my all-time favorite Pokemon, <laughs> yes. Yeah. <sighs> TCG Online, what did I do to you? What did I do to deserve this? It just wants to be cool. It, it just wants to be cruel, you mean? Wants to be tentacruel? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. tentacruel. It wants to yeah. be a cruel tent. <sighs> you know, yeah. You know, fuck tentacruels. Fuck this game. I'm out the window. <laughs> and, and then you just throw your Deku plush out the window. <laughs> <laughs> it just cuts to live action. <laughs> and I'm just on the floor dead. Don't you just hate it when your luck doesn't want to work when you need it? That's literally this stream! <laughs> that is literally oh, this whole stream! No, don't get more! Fuck you, TCG Online! <laughs> no. Okay, you know what? I'll get more when you actually mail me the shit that I actually do want. I deserve this! Okay, yeah. Uh, another solution they can, they can do for this. If you can't print off your own cards, why not just, you know mail an order of the cards that you just got. That'd be nice. The fact I have this. You cursed this! This is your fault! <laughs> Please be my friend, Brian. No! <laughs> um... You did this! You cursed this stream! You cursed my... Okay, you cursed my luck. I, I I had to rethink. I had to think about that for a second. Yeah. <laughs> you, yeah. You thing cursed is, my this, luck. This this thing is just. <laughs> not, that, not that's an oxymoron. Yeah. I have cursed luck. Okay. <laughs> this is why I like Venusaur more. 
Fuck Venusaur you. for the win! Fuck you, Charizard. Plant gang! <laughs> Plant yeah. gang. yeah! Fuck you, Charizard. Where's the Charizard gang, huh? That's right, you don't have one! <laughs> <laughs> it, died in the, it died in the 90s. Yeah, yeah, it died in the 90s, you fucking asshole. You have to get carried yeah. by you have to be carried by Reshiram to be good. And in the main series, you had to have two Mega Zones, not one. And look, they're gone now. God. This is really God. So yeah, we, we opened up all the packs. We got the stream fucking sucked. <laughs> <laughs> the stream fucking sucked. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I would like you to try lottery tickets. I don't know, Kitty. This seems pretty close. I, I don't know, Kitty. See, here's the thing. All my luck gets poured into Pokemon. If I try anything else, the luck's just not gonna work. That's, that's just that's just how things function around here. And then I go to TCG Online. I get extra mad because this exists and it says here, have me. But I mean, I would, but I'd rather have the physical of you. Yeah. And, and and then and then just to be like, oh, what's that? You want more shiny stuff? Well, here you go. I'm like, yeah, but I like this for real. Hmm. Uh. <laughs> wow, what just happened there? You know, what? I'm I'm I feel like retiring at this point. <laughs> you know what? Fuck it. No more Pokemon TCG streams. <laughs> No more of these yeah. streams. Charizard ruined it. Fuck you, Game Freak. You know Fuck you. You know what? This stream doesn't even deserve a proper outro. I'm just hitting stop stream. Fuck 